Implement bilans and trunking. This is the addressing table with seven PCs. Okay, seven PCs. Three switches and one IP phone. Configure belongs. Configure belongs on all three switches and use this table. Okay. Be careful with the names. Key sensitive. Okay. Press WB switch. Command line interface. Enter, enable, configure terminal. Okay, and basically the configuration is the same on all three switches. Okay, configure belongs on all three switches. So you need to configure this belongs. One, two, three, four, five, and six belongs with the same names on the three switches. So you can do the following. Use a notepad. And configure VLAN 10, name, key sensitive, admin, VLAN 20, name, accounts. Okay, be careful with the names, VLAN 30, name, human resources, HR, Name uh, voice, Milan 99, name management, and Milan 100, name native. Okay, the six Milans. Very good. And copy this. Okay. Go to SWB. Once you are on global configuration mode based. Now. Very good. Exit. Okay, go to SWA. Click here. Command line interface. Enter. Enable. Okay. You cannot paste the configuration here. You need to go global configuration mode, configure terminals. Okay, and here on global configuration mode based. Very good. Okay, exit. And SWC. Enable configure terminal based. Very good. Exit. Okay, assign boards to belongs. Assign access ports to belongs. On SWB and SWC, assign ports to belongs. According to the addressing table, okay, use this uh, belong assignments. Okay, go to SWB. Okay, also you can see on the topology, you can see fossil Ethernet 1 assigned to VLAN 10. Fossil Ethernet 2 assign it to VLAN 20, Fossil Ethernet 3 assign it to VLAN 30. Okay. Um, SWB Fossil Ethernet 1, VLAN 10, 2, 20, 3, 30. Okay. Go to SWB okay. interface, Fossil Ethernet 1, switch port mode access, first static access, and now access VLAN 10. Okay, and two mode access VLAN 20 and three switch port mode access and access VLAN 30. Exit. And the same way on SWC 1 to 10, 2 to 20, 3 to 30. Okay, 1 to 10, 2 to 20, 3 to 30 SWC. Okay. Um, interface for the one switch port mode access switch port access VLAN 10 to access VLAN 20 
three access VLAN theory. Okay. And look at this uh, SWC plus Ethernet 4 to VLAN 10 and 40 for voice. On SWC plus Ethernet 4 to VLAN 10 and for voice VLAN 40. Okay, SWC interface for Ethernet 4. Switch port mode access, access VLAN 10. And switch port voice VLAN 40. Exit. Okay. Configure the voice VLAN port. Okay, this is the configuration for voice. Uh, configure virtual management interfaces. Create virtual management interfaces on all three switches. Address the virtual management interfaces according to the addressing table. Okay, look at this, the three switches and uh, switch virtual interface with this IP address. Okay, and I start with SWA, switch virtual interface. Okay, SWA. Okay, be careful, SWA. And interface, VLAN. And what is the VLAN, the switch virtual interface? And you need to uh, configure on one of these uh, six VLANs. And should be on VLAN 99, the management interface, because switch virtual interface is assigned to VLAN 99. Okay, so interface belong 99. Enter and set this IP address and this subnet mask for SWA. Okay, IP address 192.168.99.252, subnet mask 24. Okay, no shutdown. Exit. SWB. SWB interface VLAN 99. Okay, IP address 192.168.99.253, subnet mask 24. I'm shut down, exit. SWC, SWC, click here. Interface VLAN 99, IP address. 192.168.99.254, subnet mask. Okay, 192.168, be careful, 99.254. No, shut down, exit. The switches should not be able to ping each other. Okay, why? Okay because uh, you need to configure trunks on the links between switches. Okay. Anyway, for example, on SWA exit, ping to SWB, 192.168.99.253. Okay, from SWA ping SWB, 192.168.99.253. Okay, ping will fail. Okay, ping fails. Uh, configure static trunk. Configure the link between SWA and SWB as a static trunk. Disable dynamic trunking on this port. Okay, this link between SWA and SWB, static trunk. So go to gigabit 01, gigabit 01 on SWB. Interface gigabit zero one switch port mode trunk okay static trunk okay sorry switch port okay very good gigabit zero one switch port mode trunk static 
disable dynamic trunking okay switch port no negotiate enter disable ddp on the switch port okay this is disable ddp configure the trunk with the native lang and eliminate native lang conflicts Okay, the native VLAN is native 100. Okay, so use uh, switch port, trunk, space, native VLAN 100. Okay, exit. Go to another side on gigabit 01 on SWA, enter. Uh, configure terminal interface gigabit 01 okay. switch port mode trunk static disable DTP okay enter enter uh, gigabit 01 switch port mode trunk okay you will see this message blocking gigabit 01 okay because on SWA the VLAN is still VLAN 1 the native VLAN is still VLAN 1 but the native VLAN on Gigabit 01 on SWB is uh, 100. So there is a VLAN mismatch. Okay, so that's why blocking Gigabit 01. But continue the configuration interface Gigabit 01, switch port mode trunk. Don't forget to disable switch port non negotiate on both sides. Switch port non negotiate to disable DTP and switch port. Trunk native VLAN 100. Exit. Okay. Okay, go to SB, click here, and you will see port consistency restored. So all is okay. And verify, for example, on SWV, enter uh, and show interface trunk gigabit 01. Trunk mode on static encapsulation AO2.1Q that one Q trunking native VLAN 100 SWA and show interface trunk gigabit 01 mode on static encapsulation AO2.1 that one Q trunking and native VLAN 100 and now configure uh, configure dynamic trunking assume that the trunk port on SWC is set to the default DTP mode for 2960 switches that is dynamic auto okay uh, configure gigabit 02 on SWA so that is successfully negotiates trunking with SWC okay go to SWA gigabit 02 configure terminal interface gigabit 02 and switch port dynamic desirable okay switch port mode dynamic desirable okay switch port mode dynamic desirable and very good and okay if this side of the link is configured uh, with dynamic desirable and the another side is configured by the file with dynamic auto the negotiation should be established to trunk okay now you can see the green indicators trunk is Negotiated trunk is established. Okay, and now configure the trunk with the native VLAN and eliminate native VLAN conflicts. Okay, on interface gigabit 02, switch port more dynamic desirable and set the native VLAN switch port trunk native VLAN 100. Exit and the same way on gigabit 02 on SWC. Okay, enter. Okay, look at this inconsistent uh, 
locking gigabit zero two, you need to fix this interface gigabit zero two. Okay, switch port trunk native native VLAN one hundred. Okay, exit. Okay, interface gigabit zero two switch port trunk native VLAN one hundred. And now port consistency restored. Very good. Okay, and try again the ping between switches. For example, from SWA ping SWB. Okay, and SWA ping SWB. SWB is 99 to 53. 192, 168, 99 to 53. Success, repeat. Okay. To SWC 254. From SWA, ping SWC 99.254. Success, repeat, success. And ping. Um, from PC1 to PC4 because they are on the same VLAN, PC1, ping to PC4, 10.11, 192.168, 10 10.11. Success. Also, PC7 is on VLAN 10, 10.12, ping to 10.12. Success. Very good. And the ping from PC2 to PC5 should should work, and from PC3 to PC6 also should should work. Okay, completion 100%. Thank you very much.